Good evening, everyone. How are you doing? Good evening, teacher. Bye, thank you, and you? Excellent. Good evening, teacher. Hello, Marlene. Hello, Olguita, Miledis. Hello, teacher. Okay. It's good to have you. Good evening. Okay. I see we have Paola, Veronica, Mayra. Okay. okay. Hello. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, no, no, no problem. Good evening. Welcome on board. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Good, evening. Good evening. Let me let me share my screen. Hello, Gladys. Good evening. Welcome on board. So good evening, everyone. Tonight is July the 29th, and the topic is Who's My Date? This is pre-intermediate, pre-intermediate one. Okay, Who's My Date? Let's begin. In the agenda tonight, we have WH questions, Who's My Date? An invitation and desires with would like. Okay, so desires with would like, would like, like. I'd like some ice cream. I'd like some tea. Or we say, wow, it's really hot. I'd like uh, tea. It's really cold. I'd like some hot chocolate. Right, so WH questions, who's my date? Invitation desires we would like. Let's go there. The objectives to discuss likes and preferences. Okay, do you remember what we studied yesterday? What were some topics we discussed in the past class? Ideas, my dear Mitos. Something that you remember that we discussed in our last class? Like and dislike. Ah, uh, we discussed like, likes and dislikes. Dislike and question are you using a uh, verb do? Mm -hmm. And the verb pre in present. Okay. In another form with W W W H question, uh, where, when, or what? Okay. Excellent. Yes. Uh, I remember the study when you singular it or plural them. Mm -hmm. Yes. I really like. It. I really like them. Mm -hmm. Yes, very good. That's nice. Okay, thank you very much. Let's move on. Tonight, we're going to begin with a race. We need to find um, these sports and leisure activities or fun activities in this grid. So um, I think I'm going to need help. Okay. So I'm going to. Let me see, choose my tool to use it. I'm going to be using a pencil. Um, let's see. You tell when you find one. In the first one, not for the second, we find score. Mm -hmm. We find score. In line number. Three, one, two, three, four. Oh my God. Number three. One. Two, athlete. Surf. Athlete. Surf. One, athlete. Two, three, athlete. Surf is in one. Athlete. Two, three, four. On the score. On the score. Athlete on the score. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Athlete. Here. Oh, okay, uh-huh. Yeah. 
Yes, on the score. In the middle, middle. Let me see, including this E, right? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. In the, Let me erase it because it looks awful. In the middle. Okay. Sir. In the middle, surf. Surf. Uh -huh. Surfing. Okay. So we have S U S U R F I N G. Surfing. Yes. Surfing. Okay. Ah, that's very good. Surfing. Nice. In the in eleven line boxing. Mm -hmm. Boxing. Mm -hmm. Eleven line. Three, six, nine here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh huh. Boxing. Boxing. To to ride. This one. Okay. Uh huh. In the fourteen, uh, swimmer. 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 In the eight, like eight. Behind eight. swimmer, teacher, eight. wrestler. Uh, behind, behind swimmer, wrestler. In the eight, like eight, skateboard. Okay. Uh, sorry, skateboarding here, right? Mm -hmm. Skate. Oh, this is very long. Skateboarding, excellent. What's cycling? The final line. Weightlifting. Weightlifting. What is another number? Judo. Judo in la columna number two. Number judo. Okay. Vertical. Gymnast. Yes. Gymnast. 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 In the primera columna. First column. Here. Then, gymnast. At the beginning, nice, but then, okay, mm. like this one. <laughs> okay. Sailing. Why not line? Sailing. 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 All right. All right. Another one. Gold uh -huh. fair in the five column. In the fifth column. Three, four, five. Let me see. One, two, three, four, five. Golfer. Yes, that's true. Golfer. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Another one. No. Has to be diagonally, probably, because it's very long. Okay. They will say, right? So. It's not that easy. Imagine. So we have archery, sailing, score, and swimmer, archery, gymnast, golfer, box, athlete. Only archery is missing. Uh, Empieza en la primera columna, teacher. Está ajá, en diagonal. De en medio hacia la hacia mi derecha. Number nine. 
Number nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, seven, eight, nine. En forma horizontal. No, es diagonal. Diagonal. Pero, o sea, es, es, es la columna número nueve. Nueve. Ah, ok. En la sí, fila uno. En diagonal. Fila uno, mm -hmm. columna nueve. Are okay. en okay. la uno. Uh -huh. Yes. This is true. Mm -hmm. Excellent. We completed it. Very good. That's all. <laughs> good job. It's nice. It's nice. Nice. Nice, very nice. So, what are the sports? Archery, athlete, boxing, golfer, gymnast, judo, karate, sailing, score, skateboarding, surfing, swimmer, track, weightlifting, and uh, wrestling. Like the rock. Okay, excellent, very good. Now, my dear, my dear ones, we have uh, uh, WH questions, okay? Let's see. The purpose is to discuss common activities, common activities. Let's look at the first man. What does the man, the first man ride? Does he ride uh, a bike? Does he ride uh, a motorcycle? Or does he ride a horse? He rides a horse. He rides a horse, right? Okay. He rides a horse. He rides a horse. What about uh, the second picture? A motorcycle. A motorcycle. A motorcycle. Okay, he's riding, we say that he's riding a motorcycle. He's riding a motorcycle. Excellent, very good. Let's see, what are the people doing in this picture? They are driving the Go car. Go car. Go car. Go car. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see, is go-karts easy to, to practice or is it difficult? Difficult. 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 Very difficult. Very difficult. Because, because it's a, a very fast around the, the place. Yes. Have you ever tried it? What? Have you ever tried it? Uh, no. <laughs> no. I tried it. Only I see. Ah, okay. I tried it many years ago when I was 22 years old because near my job, there was a track mm -hmm. and rented the cars and you could, you could pay for five, uh, five laps. Okay, one lap is one time around, right? One lap, then two laps, three laps, et cetera. So I usually rented, 10 laps, mm -hmm. that uh, 10 laps was two colones and 50 cents. So it was very cheap. 10 colones, 10 colones, two colones, 50 cents. Colones, Woo! many years ago. Long, long ago. A la 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 long, yes, a la 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 long. <laughs> years, many years ago. So yes, and it was very nice, but after, 10 laps, you felt comfortable. You know, it didn't have many, how can I say? It only had a brake and an accelerator and you, they were automatic. You didn't have to change in gear. Only forward, forward, backward. That was it, forward, backward, okay? Forward, backward, and the accelerator. That was it, accelerator, brake. Brake, accelerator, forward and backward, and that was all. And it was very nice, and they were fast. They were fast, they were very interesting. Okay, what, uh, let's say, what vehicle uh, do you think is easy to drive? 
vehicle. 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 What vehicle do you think is easy to drive? Opinion? Well, teacher, I think an automatic car is a very easy to drive it. Sure. Provided the visibility is good, yes. Because for example, Hyundai Elantra, uh, the visibility, the back part of the car, uh, the window is slanting. So the visibility is not so good in that part. So, but with practice, right, you get used to that. Mm. Let's see. My car is easy to park. Mm. It's um, a rally, it's a race, race car, rally, uh, what's your name? Uh, eclipse, no, Eclipse, no, Revolution. Okay, so an evolution, I say revolution, an evolution is a Mitsubishi Evo. Mm -hmm. it's, it's nice, at the time it was difficult to park, now it's easy. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now let's see, what sport is this for? Basketball. 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 Do you like basketball? I like yes, it. I like. Yes, I like. No, I don't. Yes, no. I do. No, I don't. What sport, what sport do you like? Well, I, I like I like basketball, soccer, and baseball, and motocross. Motocross, okay. To be honest, I cannot ride a motorcycle. When I was young, ooh, uh, my mom didn't let me ride a motorcycle. She said it was too dangerous. When I got married, my wife said, no, don't get a motorcycle. I didn't give me permission. So no permission for a motorcycle. And I said, all right. <laughs> no permission. Okay, so the motorcycle is dangerous for me. <laughs> yeah, that's what my wife told me. Motorcycles are dangerous. Don't buy a motorcycle. So okay. <laughs> Fine, no problem, I said, it's okay. <laughs> Let's look at the next picture. What, what's this lady doing? She drives a car. She drives a car, right? Do you think that she's waiting for someone? She drives an Audi. Hey, she, an Audi, of course. She's, she's waiting for a friend. Waiting for a friend, right? Do you? Boring. I, uh, teacher, I can listen. Teacher, I can listen. You can. Oh, you want me to silence the microphones? Okay. The microphones I saw are silent. I didn't do it. Okay, so. Or do you find it uh, difficult to wait? You don't like it? Yes. No, Hiki. No, se le entiende no, mucho, teacher. Oh. Ah, está entrecortado, teacher. No, no, no podemos unir las, las, las ideas. Ah, okay. Is, do you think that is my microphone? Yes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Ay, ahorita nos van a expulsar. Yo creo. My microphone. Can you hear me now? Oh, yes. Now oh, yes. It, yes. Oh, yes. So, yeah, maybe, maybe. All right. Let's see. 
Okay. I'm excited, ¿no? 28 questions. Richard, no se escucha, se escucha al fondo otra, otra clase. Aún hay micrófonos abiertos, eso es. Ah, ese es. Ok. Let me turn them off. Ok. That's it. Ok. Now, yes, we have 28 questions. Probably in the class we will not have enough time to practice the 28 but um, you can practice in your house, okay? What do you do for a living? Where do you live? Where do you work? Where do you study? Why do you get up early? How often do you cook? What time do you study the lesson? What kind of movies do you like? What do you do after work? Where do you go on weekends? How often do you go out? When do you watch TV? Who cooks in your house? Who takes out the trash? Who cleans up at home? Who watches TV with you? How long does it take you to shower? What time do you take a shower? When do you study the lesson? Why do you need to relax? How often do you get a haircut? How often do you cut your nails? Who helps you with homework? How long do you use the computer? Where do you go shopping? How often do you go jogging? And how long do you listen to music? How often do you practice your English? Now, I want volunteers to ask their partners questions. Okay, we're going to practice like yesterday. One person, will choose five people and ask five questions, okay? So you select in order, now you select the question, okay? Choose the question, five questions, and you ask five people. One question, one question, one question, one question. Okay, Jennifer Noemi is the first. Okay. Olguita. No. What do you do for a living? Number one. Number one. Uh, uh, I don't remember what it means living. What, what do, you, do you do what for do you, a living? <laughs> What's your job? What do you do? Okay. For, what's your job? Okay. Um, I, I, I do for a living in my home and I work to my computer. Okay. Paola Marie, perdón. Okay. Paola Maria, um, where do you work? I don't work, I study. And Ana Julissa, uh, how often do you cook? Repeat, please. What number? Uh, six. How often do you cook? Excuse me, repeat again. How often oh. do you cook? Yes, I usually cook the dinner. Carlos Daniel, what do you do after work? What do you do after work? Yeah. Uh, well, I study English, I practice English, and I clean my house. Uh, Gloria Elizabeth, uh, when do you watch TV? 
I I sometimes series. I I sometimes watch series. Excellent. Okay, thank you very much, Jennifer. Thank you very much. Okay, very good. Now, my friends, when you ask how often, this is asking about frequency. Frequency, how often do you cook? Uh, I cook every day, or I cook three times a day, or I cook once a week, or, okay, frequency, how often? How often do you take a shower? I take a shower every day. How often do you study English? Study English? What's that? Ah, no. How often do you study English? I study English every night. How often do you read a book? I never read a book. Okay. So how often? Uh -huh. Very good. Now, Olguita, your turn. Five people. Okay. Uh, uh, Glorita. What do you do? Uh, I'm sorry. Where do you go on weekends? Where do you go? On weekends. I visit my parents. It's good. <laughs> um, Veronica. Who cooks in your house? Um, I am. Oh, it's good. <laughs> you cook. I do. do. <laughs> okay. Uh, Miladis. Hello. Uh, who, how long does it uh, take you to shower? How long, repeat please. How long does it take you to shower? Um, 20 minutes 40, 45 minutes oh it's long shower yeah, it's a long time <laughs> yes. okay Rolando Rigoberto how often do you cut your nails uh, good evening good evening how often do you cut your nails? How often? How often do you cut your nail? Cut your nail. Nail. You know this? Estoy ubicando de qué número es. 22. Uh, 22. 22. How Number 22. Cut your nails. Oh. Uh, uh, Um, la siguiente sería porque no, no, no le comprendo muy bien ahí la, la... Uh, how often do you cut your nails teacher what is nails uñas 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 cut uh, I yes how often is every okay once a week once a month Every month. month, every day, never, okay. <laughs> uh, Sometimes. <laughs> yes, one, uh, para decir una vez al mes. One month. One month. Uh -huh. one, okay, one, thank you. One a month, once a month. Once a month, okay. Marta Estela. Uh, how often do you practice your English? Uh, always. I always oh. practice English. Oh, it's good. Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's all, teacher. <laughs> thank you, Olguita. You're very kind. Thank you very much. Now, Veronica Alfaro, your turn. Okay. So, of course, Veronica Alfaro, okay? Uh, so go ahead. Only, okay, only, only, only question for people. 
Yes. Uh, five questions. Okay. Okay. And um, Miladis Barahona, um, number uh, seven. What time do you? What time do you study the lesson? Um, one hour for day. What time? At seven p.m. At eight o'clock. Um, what time? Seven at eight at nine. Okay. I'm studying one hour for day in. Sorry, sorry. Okay. Mm, I don't have the specific uh, time. No specific time. Okay. okay. Thank you. Over here, there is a mistake. What time okay. would you? What time do you? Sorry. Over here, my fingers. <laughs> Yeah, my fingers. You know, I'm not a very good typist. I'm a teacher, not a secretary, but I try to do the best I can to help you. But over here, I made a mistake. What time do you study the lesson? Uh -huh. Okay. So go ahead. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Um, uh, Elsa Natalia, mm, uh, number 11. How often do you go out? Excuse me. Uh, How number... often do you go? Okay, only the people who are the uh, uh, only the people who are speaking activate the microphone. Okay, so continue, please. Okay, number eleven. How often do you go out? Mm -mm. And. I need help because I can understand the question. Okay, thank you. Let's see. How often is for frequency? How frequently, how often do you go out? Go out, go to the movies, go to a restaurant. Okay, go out. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, sometimes, I go out on weekend. Um, on weekend. <laughs> okay. Once once a month. Once a month, excellent. Uh -huh. Once a month I go to I go to my father's house and oh I visit um my sister house. Okay. Excellent. Thank you very much. Now continue. Thank you. Okay. Um, Siomara Arabia, number um, 17. How long does it take you to shower? How long does it take you to shower? Mm -hmm. Twenty minutes, ten minutes, forty-five minutes, an hour. Okay. Image. Okay. Okay. Uh, other people. Yes, please choose another person. Okay, Paola Maria. Um. Question twenty-one. How often do you get hair cut? Uh -huh. Get a haircut. I am um, once um, a year. Yeah. Mm, uh -huh. Sure. Or twice a year. No, once a year. <laughs> once a year. Okay. Excellent. Very good. Thank you very much. Now, practice these questions in your house, right? Practice the questions in your house. Remember, how often is frequency? How often do you go jogging? Every, every morning or once a week, once a month, etc. How long means how much time? How much time? How long do you listen to music? One hour, two hours, three hours, all afternoon, etc. 
how, okay, so here we have how often and how long. And there is another how, no, only how often and how long, right? I put in here, okay. Then for the others, I think they are more common. Why? Why do you take a shower? I, because it's very hot. Ah, okay, because it's very hot. Oh, because we need to be clean. <laughs> okay, let's move on. Who's my date? Who's my date? The purpose is to discuss your ideal partner. Okay, don't worry. I'm not going to ask you, do you have a boyfriend? Do you have a girlfriend? Are you married? Do you have, no, 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 no. Why not? This is not the purpose of the course, okay? <laughs> However, to discuss your ideal partner. Okay, what's the meaning? Um, for, a, for a person to be an ideal partner means boyfriend, girlfriend, husband, or for the, for the boys, girlfriend or wife, right? Or for the girls, husband or boyfriend, uh, what's important? What's important for, I mean, for you to choose the person? Honesty, intelligence, integrity, what qualities are important? Domestic. Sorry, do domestic. Honesty. I'm sorry. Honesty. Honesty. I heard domestic and I said, what? Okay, a domestic boyfriend? No, that's okay. Yes, when we get married, okay. <laughs> okay. So, okay, honesty. Excellent. Honesty. Another one. Polite. Polite. Intelligent. Kind. Kind. Sincere. Right? Sincere. Love. Respectful. Mm -hmm. What else? Responsible. Responsible. Mm -hmm. Punctual. Imagine you say, hey, let's go to the movies. What time? At 2 p.m. Ooh, 3 p.m., 4 p.m. Where is the boy? Where is El Bicho? And he is not around. Okay. So it's not punctual. Too bad. Okay, what's another characteristic? We do think I think that we said the most important. Uh, disciplinado, I don't. Disciplined, disciplined, Di disciplined. Yes. Romantic. Romantic. Okay. All right. Romantic. Okay. Very good. We're going to see here in this conversation that is like two pages long, uh, we see how they find the idea. Okay, let's listen and practice. Okay, this is how it goes. Applause, teacher, what's applause? Excellent, yes, applause. Clap, not because of the microphone. <laughs> Clap in the leg only. So you say, welcome to Who's My Date? Today, Linda is going to meet Bill, John, and Tony. So let's start with the first question on music. Bill, what kind of music do you like? Oh, classical music. Classical, okay. And how about you, John? Well, I like jazz. And you, Tony? My favorite music is rock. How about you, Linda? Well, I like pop music. I don't like jazz or classical music very much. Applause. Now, okay, now let's talk about movies. Bill, what kind of movies do you like? I like thrillers. And how about you, John? Oh, I like Westerns. Right? Westerns. Westerns are good. And how about you, Tony? I love horror movies. Dracula, Frankenstein. And what about you, Linda? I really like horror films too. Applause. And now for question number three, 
Bill, what kind of programs do you like? Well, I like to watch news programs. John, uh, well, you know, I really like talk shows. And Tony, what about you? I like game shows a lot. And Linda, what do you like? Well, I like talk shows and game shows. Okay, time's up. Now, who's the best day for Linda? Applause. Okay, very good. Now, for this conversation, we need a four people, five people we need. Okay, so hostess, one person. The hostess is going to be Olguita. Okay. Okay, then Bill is going to be Roberto. Roberto is going to be Bill. Okay, teacher. Okay. Then uh, Glorita is going to be John. Okay. And Tony, Tony is going to be Marlene. Marlene is going to be Tony. Veronica is going to be Linda. Okay, I guess those are the five people. Okay, let's begin with the diet. Okay. Okay. Welcome to Who's My Date. Today, Linda is going to meet Bill, John, and Tony. So let's start with the first question on music. Bill, what kind of music do you like? Oh, classical music. Classical? Okay, and um, how about you, John? Well, I like jazz. And you, Tony? My favorite music is rock. How about you, Linda? Well, I like pop music. I don't like jazz or classical music very much. Applause. Oh. Now let's talk about movies. Bill, what kind of movie do you like? I like thrillers. And how about you, John? Oh, I like westerns. Westerns are good. And how about you, Tony? I love horror films. And what about you, Linda? I really like horror, horror films too. Applause. Yeah. <laughs> and now for question number three, Bill, what kind of TV program do you like? Well, I like to watch news programs. John? Oh, well, you know. I really like tall shop. And Tony, how about you? I like game show a lot. Mm -hmm. And Linda, what do you like? Well, I like talk show and game show. <laughs> okay, time is up. Now, who's the best date for Linda? <laughs> Very good. Now, from the conversation, who do you think is the best date for Linda? Tony, John, or Bill? I think it's Tony. It's Tony. Yes, Tony, because he likes game shows and Linda likes game shows too. Right? Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. And Linda likes horror movie, horror movies, and Tony likes horror movies. Mm -hmm. So I mm -hmm. think that Tony, even Tony, is ready with the flowers. Okay, he has his flowers ready for Linda. Okay, which is cute. Okay, very cute. <laughs> yes. Now let's see. We have other volunteers for the second. Sorry, Miladis Barahona is the host. Yes. You are the hostess, okay? Okay. It's Bill, okay? 
Hey, teacher. Carlos Daniel is Bill. Now, another boy for, for John. Marvin? No teacher, no Marvin. So, well, then another girl for, we're going to have another, it's not going to be John, it's going to be Jonna. Ah, okay. So, Jean. Okay, yes, uh, glad you said that. It's going to be Jean, and Karen is going to be Tony. Okay. I think, I think, ah, and Linda, who is going to be Linda? Teacher, all of us are Lindas. No, yes, but who's going to be Linda in the dialogue? Okay. Can I say your teacher, pardon? Oh, yes, it's true. Sorry. Okay. So let's begin. We're ready. Okay. The others. Welcome. Next. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. That's okay. Begin. Welcome to Who's Must Day today. Linda is going to meet Bill, John, and Tony. So let's start with the first question on music. Bill, what kind of music do you like? Uh, classical music. Classical, okay. And how about you, John? Well, yo soy John, ¿verdad? You are John. Will, I like it. I like jazz. And you, Tony? My favorite music is rock. How about you, Linda? 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 No, Linda. Linda. <laughs> We're going to choose another Linda. Okay, Jenny, do you want to be Linda? I am teacher. No, yes, in the dialogue. Who is Linda? Jemmy? No, Jemmy, no. That's not. Hola? Yes. Yeah. Linda. <laughs> okay. You want to? Uh, well, I like folk music. I don't like jazz or classical music very much. Okay. Now let's talk about movies. Bell, what kind of movie do you like? Like thrillers. And how about you, John? Oh, I like Western. What Western are good. And how about you, Tony? I love horror films. And what about you, Linda? I really like horror films too. And now for question number three, Bill, what kind of TV program do you like? Well, I like to watch news programs. John? I will you now. I really like that show. And Tony, how about you? I, I, I like the show a lot. And Linda? What do, do you like? Well, I do talk shows and gay show. Okay, <laughs> time is up. How now who is the best day for Linda? Applause. Yeah. Okay, applause. Very good. Okay, now let's see the other players for the next the last. This is the last round because of time. Um, I have Paola Maria. Paola Maria is going to be the hostess. I have Jamilev Castro, Stephanie Villafuerte, 
and Julissa and Eric Colacci. Okay, very good. So let me see. Yes, I got it. Okay, let's see who is who. Okay, uh, the hostess we said, right? Paola Maria. Jamie Castro is going to be there. Stephanie Villafuerte is going to be Linda. Tony is going to be Julissa. And there was a boy, Eric Colocho, right? Eric Colocho is going to be John. So let me see. I have Bill, John, and Tony, right? And Linda, who's going to be Linda? Mm. Ana Julissa Aguilar, Linda. Or you are, uh, am I confused? Yes, because I, I don't, I haven't written your names, I can be confused. Okay, let's begin. Welcome to Who's My Day Today. Linda is going to meet Bill, John, and Tony. So let's start with the first question on music. Bill, what kind of music do you like? Oh, classical music. Classical, okay. And how about you, John? Well, I like jazz. And you, Tony? Okay. Maybe Tony's. Just like Tony. Yes, you are Tony. My favorite music is rock. What about you, Linda? Well, I like pop music. I don't like jazz or classical music very much. Applause. Yes, applause. Okay, now let's start. Now let's talk about movies. Bill, what kind of movies do you like? I like trailers. And how about you, John? Oh, I like westerns. Westerns are good. And how about you, Tony? I love horror films. And what about you, Linda? I really like horror films too. Applause. And now for question number three. Bill, what kind of TV programs do you like? Well, I like to watch new programs. John? Oh, well, you know, I really like talk shows. And Tony, how about you? I like game shows a lot, a lot. And Linda, what do you like? Well, I like talk shows and game shows. Okay, <laughs> time is up. Now, who's the best day for Linda? Applause. Excellent, very good. Now, we don't have time for another round, so let's move on. Okay, thank you for the ones who participated and the ones who didn't have the chance next time, okay? Thank you, let's move on. Now you're going to have a chance. The ones who didn't participate, please raise your hand and you're going to participate in this other diet. We have conversation and invitation. Okay, the purpose is to discuss your ideal partner now, now is to invite your ideal partner someplace. I didn't, I didn't notice that I didn't change the purpose, but the purpose is obvious to invite someone, right? Okay, listen and practice the conversation. I have tickets to the concert match on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks, I'd love to. What time does it start? At eight. That sounds great. So, do you want to have dinner at six? Oh, I'd like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match around 7.30. Okay, let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. Okay, 
Now then, uh, this is the, the conversation. I have tickets, okay? So let's begin with the, with the people, let's begin with the people that didn't have a chance, the people who didn't have an opportunity to participate in the other one. Okay, let me see who are, can you raise your hands? The ones who didn't have the opportunity to participate in the one before? Uh -huh. I see two hands. Okay, I have Stephanie Villafuerte and Catherine Canjura. Okay, I'm going to have one girl inviting another girl. Okay, Stephanie is going to be Dave and Catherine is going to be Susan. Okay, begin. Stephanie will be Dave. Yes, Stephanie, Dave, and Catherine. Susan. I have ticket to the soccer mm -hmm. match of Friday night. Well, would you like to go? Would you like to go? Thanks, I love it. What time does it start? Mm, at eight. That sounds great. So do you want to have dinner at, at six? Oh, I'd like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match around 7.30. Okay, let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. Good excuse, right? Okay, Dave looks at the wallet. One dollar. Okay, one dollar and the tickets. Oh, you know, I have to work late. Okay, so no money for dinner, for dinner then. So he said, no, I have to work late. Let's meet at the gate. Teacher, the gate, the entrance, at the entrance of the stadium. Okay, so that he doesn't pay for transportation and he doesn't pay for dinner, okay? Good move, okay? Let's see. Um, I need other two volunteers. My teacher, Marlene. Okay, Marlene and Karen Bernal. So, uh, well, okay. Katia didn't participate in the one before, right? Katia Lisbeth. Marlene and Katia, then. Uh, Karen okay. is going to go in the next one, okay? So, okay. Katia, me, Dave, teacher. Yes, Katia is going to be Dave, and uh, Karen Bernal is going to be, no, who did I say? I said one, okay, one of the two that I mentioned are going to be Dave, and the other is going to be Susan, okay? Let's, yes, and Veronica will be next, okay? Together with Karen Bernal. Okay, let's begin. Okay. I have a ticket to the soccer mat on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks. I love to. What time does it start? At eight. That's so great. So, do you want to have dinner at six? Is... Oh, six. At six. six. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'd like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before they match around 7.30. 7.30? Okay, let's meet at the gate. That's all fine. See you there. See okay. you there. Yes. There okay. Finish. Okay. Uh -huh. Remember, say, do, do you want? Do you want? Okay. And would, would you like? Would you like to go? 
would you like? Would in contracted is either, either love to, I'd love to, either love to, I'd love to. Okay, excellent. Now the ones that I said they were Karen and Miss Calhura, Dorin, Catherine, right? Okay. And Catherine is Susan. Mm -hmm. sure. Excuse me. Uh, I is equal to I would like. Um, uh, either uh, is the contracted for I would. Ah, sí. ah. Why you say either like or either love? I love is I would love. I like is I would like. And of course. Uh, okay. The two express desire to participate, desire to do something. Okay, that would be the idea. Okay, Thank thanks for the question. Thanks for the question. Okay, dear ladies, begin, please. Karen and Catherine. Teacher, sorry, I am Dave. Who, who is speaking? Catherine. Me, Catherine. Catherine. Okay. Catherine is Susan and Karen is Dave. Okay. Okay. I have a ticket to the soccer mat on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks. I love it. What time does it start? At eight. That sounds great. So do you want to have dinner at six? Um, I like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before the match around 7.30. Okay, let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. See you. Very good. Now let's continue. So we don't have much time for this, but the important thing here is what time does it start? Would you like to go? What time do you start? Do you want to have dinner at six? Okay. And uh, that is for the invitation. We're going to be practicing invitations right now. That is the other part. Okay. Here we're going to have different people. Different people. Okay. Oh, I don't have much time. I'm going to steal two minutes from the other class, but I need uh, two volunteers right now to invite someone to the beach and someone to the movies, because that's all the time that we have. Would you like to go to the beach? Would you like to go to the movies? Okay, I have Gloria Castellanos. Okay, it's going to be one and Veronica Alfaro is the other one for the moment. Okay, begin the first conversation. I choose the 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 person. Uh, no. Um, oh, Veronica, with Veronica. Veronica, yes. Okay, Veronica, would you like to go to the beach with me next Saturday? I love to. What time? Okay. okay. Thank I you. love it too, but I love had to work that day. Okay, this is to accept, you say, I'd love to, what time? Okay, and the person says, oh, at 6 p.m. Oh, at at, at 10 p.m., uh, 10 p.m. Wow. No, 10 at 10 in the morning, in the morning. 10 a.m., okay, 10 a.m., it's okay. And if you don't have time or you don't want to go, you say, I'd love to, but I have to work that day. I love to. I have, I have but to study I have for to work that day. I love to, but I don't have money. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Right. I'd love to, but okay. Very good. Thank you very much. So, the next one, the next volunteers, next two pairs, or next two pairs, next pair. Who's the next one? Would be my time finished. Okay, I have Jamilet Castro and Roberto Betancourt. Okay, very good. Okay, uh, Roberto, would you like to go to 
the movies with me next Saturday? I love to. What time? At 6 p.m. Okay, excellent. Very good. Now, oh, I thank you very much for the other four who raised your hands. I would have to leave right now because I have the other class waiting for me. And they said yes, teacher, we were late, right? So I have to leave right now. Thank you very much for being so wonderful, for participating. Enjoy your vacation. Okay, next week we don't have classes, but please work. Okay. I'm going to, sorry, I didn't send you the information today. I had to go out. I had to leave because I had other things to do. And I'm going to I promise that tomorrow is going to be another day and I'm going to send you this one and yesterday's class, okay? So, okay, teacher, enjoy your holidays. Happy and vacation. Happy vacation to you too, okay? Join the vacation. Yes, thank you. Good night, take care. Good night. Bye. 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 Bye.